church. Necesitamos saber eso, como estaba diciendo César, para muchas cosas, pero una de las cosas también es saber la, 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 la cantidad de niños que tienen y qué edades son para planear, por ejemplo, las clases de, de doctrina en el futuro, cosas así. Y también, si vamos a ir más... some of the um, the ancient features of this church yet it has been destroyed through several different periods of the time still it is kept that uh, amazing uh, beauty of the old Spanish colonial features in here at the at the altar it's got the uh, presume it's the old features of the original church here. There we are. It's a very Spanish uh, church.
the gentleman from Texas of uh, San Antonio and I've been talking to him and he's wearing a Texan uh, Texan hat, more like a Marlboro style, is that right? As, it's a slightly uh, variant on the Mexican hat, but if you look at it very straight, unless you know the features of it, um, you might um, very much mix it up with a Mexican or a Texan style hat. But it's more featured from a Mexican style, the old days, I yeah. presume, isn't it? Because yeah. the Texans never so. had, had, had the idea of hats oh, these yeah. days, because they were not exposed to the heat. Yeah, there um, you go. So, of course, so, uh, then it was, of course, uh, depend on the styling. Um, it has been uh, styled to more look like uh, Texan. Um, the hat here is slightly um, uh, soiled because it's been worn, and that's the features of the hat, of course. And uh, it's uh, roughly about two to three hundred dollars, and uh, this particular one is over two hundred and eighty dollars in in, in 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 value, monetary value. So it is a great feature, I should say. Um, yeah, thank you.